2 Peter chapter 1 and verse 11 talked about the everlasting kingdom. Now, what does that mean? Like I said, it's more than just the sweet by and by. It's right here now. The kingdom happens wherever the blessing, Galatians 3, 13 and 14, wherever the blessing manifests because the glory is in the blessing. A lot of Christians have that wrong. They say, God, rain down your glory. Shine down your glory. And God's saying to us, I already have. And it's in you. Don't ask it to come down. You make it go up. (laughs) Up out of you. Hallelujah. Radiate with it. Shine with it. That's why the Apostle John spends so much time talking about that the light is in us and we're children of the light and no longer of the darkness because the light is in you. Glorious light. When God said, light be, that wasn't the light of the sun or the reflected light of the moon. That was his glory. And that same glory has been put in you that lit the universe. It's in you. And you can say when you stand and believe God for your victory, light, be. And no devil in hell that loves the darkness can stand the presence and manifestation of that light. Oh, church, I say, it's a day of victory.